So you go to the bank and say, hello, Mr. Bank Manager, I've got this great game. It's a role playing game, which you're a hero or a wizard, and you go on these fantastic journeys of the mind. And the bank manager looks at you rather like an Alsatian watching television and looks totally bemused and rushes you out the door. Two old school friends moved to London and having really lousy jobs, we decided wouldn't it be great just to somehow start a business based on the, our passion, which was playing board games. So this is the very first newsletter we put out. This is Al and Weasel. And we sent Al and Weasel out to everybody new in games. And one of the recipients was a man who was called Gary Gygax. Now, Gary Gygax had just invented a game called Dungeons and Dragons. So we decided to do was take the money that we'd already made from Games Workshop and f finance a trip to the state. So we walked into this dealer's room. The star attraction was Dungeons and Dragons. It had come out, it started selling well. A copy of Dungeons and Dragons, still in its shrink wrap. Uh, this is a 1975 edition. Yep, as good as new. So we ordered six copies, all the money we had in our lives. And on the back of that huge order, we got the exclusive distribution agreement for Europe for three years. When I went through my parents' stuff, I found this letter which I'd wrote to him. Just a quick note to let you know that I'm alive and well, but still homeless. I'm currently putting my head to rest in Steve's van. It was a stinky old van. It was cold and raining, but yeah, we loved it. And eventually it, it just became too much. I mean, people were traveling down from all over the, the country to come to Games Workshop. We went through the good times and the bad times. I mean, the combination worked out well. We, we both understood the way business is supposed to, to work. So we've gone through some, you know, some ups and downs, a few <laughs> arguments along the way but we survived all those and we're still the best of friends today. Mm -hmm.